everyone, we are here again at the Chinita Mexican Bar and Grill in Village Square, Las Vegas. And here is this week's top star. Despite downside risks in key emerging market economies and a deeper recession in the Eurozone, the International Monetary Fund projected the world's economy would grow 3.1% in 2013. The global lender said that its initial projection was 0.2% higher, but growth had been affected by increased financial market volatility and rising interest rates in advanced economies since its last report in April. China and other emerging economic powers now face new risks, including the possibility of a longer growth slowdown. The recent update explained that the emerging market economies have generally been hit hardest as recent increases in advanced economy interest rates and asset price volatility combined with weaker domestic activity have led to some capital outflows, equity price declines, rising local yields, and currency depreciation. The expected U.S. Federal Reserve's unwinding of its massive monetary policy stimulus could trigger sustained capital outflows from emerging markets. But since real policy rates are low already, coupled with exchange rate depreciation, Capital outflows are expected to be contained, said the IMF report. We are very interested to know what is your take on this issue. So email us your thoughts at theagentglobalnews at theagentv.com. Here in Las Vegas, the wildfire sparked by lightning on Mount Charleston is burning homes, which led to a mandatory evacuation of homes in Trout and Kyle Canyons. Red Cross bookman Lloyd Zell said Hafen Elementary School in Pahrump and Bill Bray Elementary School in Las Vegas have been converted to shelters and people affected by the fire can simply proceed to these schools. Several local casino companies are teaming with American Red Cross of Southern Nevada to provide hotel rooms to people evacuated from their homes. However, some affected residents refuse to leave without their pets. Nevada law requires that a political subdivision or a local organization for emergency management must without limitation address the needs of persons with pets, service animals, or service animals in training during and after an emergency or disaster. People consider pets as part of their family. It is indeed a blessing that Gina Gritson, president of the Nevada Voters for Animals, has led a volunteer group that has agreed to transport and temporarily shelter the animals. Other locations, such as Bonnie Springs Ranch, are making space available to shelter horses. Two pet shelter mobile units and a horse trailer were deployed Friday morning to set up outside Bilbray Elementary School, said Irene Navi, Plans Operation Coordinator for Emergency Management with Clark County. Now families with pets in need of help can contact Bonnie Springs Ranch at 702-875-4191 or the American Red Cross at 702-791-3311. I'm Nancy Monte, your host for VAsian Global News. In a recent report by Channel News Asia, India has lost out to Philippines as call center capital of the world. In five years, 10% of India's share of global outsourced voice-related services transferred to Philippines. Industry experts said Filipinos have better communication skills and they speak English in a better way that can be understood by more people. Jirin Singh, manager at GNXT Recruiter, said, The problem is communication, their accent. People from other countries are not able to understand. Apart from this, our government is not helpful at all. Infrastructure is the problem as well. High costs of land and office rental have put pressure on the business, processing outsource for BPO industry in India. Call centers are especially vulnerable since a typical business will need space for 150 to 200 employees. Many companies dealing in India are starting to move away from voice-related services, partly because it is not easy to change the Indian accent, but also because it is hard to compete with the Philippines, which has a well-educated workforce and cultural affinity to the U.S., where many of the calls originate. Still, there are some who believe the call center industry can return to its high growth phase with government support, better infrastructure, and training facilities. The Solar Impulse, a 100% solar-powered aircraft, completed the final leg of a history-making cross-country flight, gliding to a smooth stop at New York's John F. Kennedy International Airport. The flight, which took off from Dallas International Airport in Washington, D.C., completed the final leg of the cross-continental journey that started in California in early May. The flight plan for the revolutionary plane, powered by some 11,000 solar cells on its oversized wings, included flying by the Statue of Liberty before landing early Sunday in New York. But an unexpected tear discovered on the left wing of the aircraft Saturday afternoon 
forced officials to scuttle the flyby and proceed directly to JFK for a landing three hours earlier than scheduled. It was a huge success for renewable energy, pilot Andre Forsberg said while standing in front of Solar Impulse on the runway at JFK. The only thing that failed was a piece of fabric. Co-pilot Bertrand Picard said the journey obligated the whole team to develop new skills and strategies which push the boundaries of clean technologies and renewable energies to unprecedented levels. The aircraft soars to 30,000 feet while poking along at a top speed of 45 miles per hour. It weighs about the size of a small car and soars with what is essentially the power of a small motorized scooter. The Solar Impulse left San Francisco in early May and has made stopovers in Phoenix, Dallas-Fort Worth, St. Louis, Cincinnati, and Washington, D.C. The cross-country flight is a tune-up for a planned 2015 flight around the globe with an upgraded version of the plane. Moving on to the local front, the Southern Nevada Health District is encouraging everyone to have a soda-free summer. Research has linked sugar sweetened drinks to higher rates of obesity, oral health problems, and poor diets. To help Southern Nevadans to kick the habit, the district will launch its soda-free summer initiative. It's an effort to encourage kids and adults to choose more helpful beverages and reduce eliminate the sugary ones. This includes fat-free or 1% milk, unsweetened tea or black coffee, cutting just one soda per day, you can reduce your daily calorie intake by approximately 150 calories. So if you want to take the soda-free summer pledge, log on to GetHealthyClarkCounty.org. This is Ayn Armato reporting for VH and Global News. We'd like to hear your feedback, so email us at vhnglobalnews at vhntv.com and we'll even send you a free gift. I'm Nancy Monse, reporting for VH and Global News. Stand by for my scrumptious segment, Dish of the Week. Stay tuned for Home Sweet Home with Mark and Melody. And this is Shannon Yang, keeping you informed on VH and Global News. to DirecTV today and get a free upgrade to the all-new Genie, our most advanced HD DVR ever. Genie serves your entire home with just one receiver, allows you to record any five shows at once, and gives you up to three times more HD recording capacity than cable. Order now and lock in your savings for two years. Other packages start at just $29.99 a month. So get all your TV wishes granted. Switch to DirecTV and get your free upgrade to Genie today. Welcome to the segment of Home Sweet Home on Asian Global News. I'm Mark Bowman and I'm one of your hosts. And I'm Melody Mojica, co-host for this real estate segment and this is our feature story for the week. Summer is here and the pool parties are happening, but unlike the major casinos with lifeguards standing by, homeowners should take precaution and add as many water safety steps as possible to assure a safe and fun experience in your swimming pool or spa. Here are some safety tips you can adopt. Always watch your children when they are in or near a swimming pool. Teach your children basic water safety tips. Keep children away from pool drains, pipes, and other openings to avoid entrapments. Have a portable telephone close by. If your child is missing, look for him or her in the pool or spa first. Share safety instructions with families, friends, and neighbors. Learn how to swim and teach your child how to swim. Learn to perform CPR on your children and adults and update those skills regularly. And understand the basics of life savings so that you can assist in a pool emergency. Drowning is a preventable cause of death and injury for children. By putting proven safety behaviors and systems into practice, you and your family will be much more secure and in around swimming pools. The Consumer Product Safety Commission recommends that you create a safety toolkit that is kept near your pool or spa to ensure that if the worst happens, you are ready to respond. For more information about these pool safety tips, visit PoolSafely.gov. So Mark, do you have any other safety advice for people that have swimming pools or are looking to buy uh, homes with pools? Well, that's a very good story. I have a two and a three year old grandbabies and oh. uh, man, they're missing in a second. So <laughs> I do know from past experience, though I'm not a safety expert, that having a self-closing locking gate on any perimeter wall is required. Okay. And also having an alarm on the door when, you, when you're from the interior to the exterior of the home is, uh, is, is a requirement for a new pool, but also recommended if you have an older pool. 
but yeah, so as many berries as possible is is always recommended. Yeah, absolutely. Especially how old are your um, your uh, two and three? Oh wow! And so do they, they get, know how to swim? Uh, they have been in pools, but uh, actually, I just met somebody last week who volunteered to teach them to swim. So it's I'm wonderful. looking forward to that. <laughs> That's the best part. You get to be with them in there with them, right? You're yes. gonna help. <laughs> okay, absolutely. Wonderful. Wonderful. Well, thank you. <laughs> If you or anyone you know have questions or need our assistance in buying or selling your home, we have the proven track record and the experience to help you. In fact, we offer our clients free attorney services on short sales. Again, that's no cost to you, and we've helped many of our viewers already. Remember, at 048 Realty, we're the experts and we're here to help you. So call us now at 721-7474. Also, if you're in the healthcare field, finance industry, or own a local business and would like to be a guest on our or a sponsor on, on Home Sweet Home, please visit us at info at homesweethometv.com. Thank you for watching our Home Sweet Home section on the Asian Global News. For behind the scene photos of our guests and the production crew of the Asian Global News, pick up a copy of the Philippine Times at your favorite Asian store. This is Mark Bowman for Home Sweet Home. Also, like my Facebook page, Melody, your Vegas host, for updates, events, and links to past episodes. This is Melody Mojica. Don't go away. We'll be right back with Vision Global News. Switch to DirecTV today and get a free upgrade to the all-new Genie, our most advanced HD DVR ever. Genie serves your entire home with just one receiver, allows you to record any five shows at once, and gives you up to three times more HD recording capacity than cable. Order now and lock in your savings for two years. Other packages start at just $29.99 a month. So get all your TV wishes granted. Switch to DirecTV and get your free upgrade to Genie today. Welcome back to the Asian Global News. Having fun in triple digit heat is a breeze only if you know where to go. And last week we strolled along Lake Las Vegas in Henderson, some 25 miles off the strip. Now you will not believe this thing exists in a desert environment and sits just 10 miles from the strip. It's a wet and wild Las Vegas, a water theme park at the corner of Fort Apache and Warm Spring Road. Set on 41 acres in southwest Las Vegas near the I-215 and Sunset Road, the world-class park features more than 25 innovative slides and attractions. The park is managed by theme park experts, Village Roadshow Theme Parks, which operates Wet n Wild Water Parks in Arizona and Hawaii. Wet n Wild Las Vegas has the potential to entertain more than 650,000 guests annually, providing them with a world-class day of family fun. And if you've actually been there recently, you know they're not exaggerating. They have recently been denying entry because there's simply so many people inside and outside. It's wise to go online to wetandwildlasvegas.com to check their calendar and if there is any available space for your desired date. And if you need to be there early, before they declare the park is full. Tennis Hall of Famers Andre Agassi and Steffi Graf together with Steven and Karen Thomas of Thomas Mack have invested in Wet n Wild. Coming up next is Island Emery's Only Nine segment featuring a cool band named ST1. Enjoy! Island Emery here in the middle of the desert, uh, putting it down. Got ST1 in the house. What's up, brothers? How's it going, man? Good, man, good. We got these guys representing the island of Guam. The music that you guys represent, uh, it's uh, feel good island music, right? Yeah. yeah. So, um, um, it's basically, like, you know, if you, if you think about it, like, growing up in, in Guam, Jawain was a big thing. Yeah, that Jawain style. The, the, the old Jawain style with the reggae, and, you know, just the reggae roots. And, you know, the older I got, the more chill I got. I got some back to roots reggae music. And, right. You know, we try to, now everybody's like, we don't play Jawine anymore, but you know, you know, you guys love Jawine music. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what uh, well, talk about Jawine music? It's uh, a mixture of uh, uh, island music and reggae. Uh, but uh, what artists uh, did you guys follow? You know, became uh, growing up. You know, of course, we had Bob Marley and and ev everybody who played. You know, everybody who played in the little bars and stuff in Hawaii was huge on Guam. So Hawaii, Connie, uh -huh. Fiji, Ikolu, all those guys growing up. You know, um, Crater Boys. Bubba B, you know, <laughs> stuff like that. 
that's that's the kind of stuff you grow up listening to, you know. And it's, it's crazy, you know. <laughs> it is crazy. <laughs> well, because here in Vegas, you know, I was like, we get to chill with these guys. And yeah. I was like, you know, 13 years ago, that. if you had asked yeah. me, I would have been like, man, crazy, bro. I'm gonna be playing in the garage for the rest of my life. St. One, how was that created? Well, I was created. Uh, you know, I, I met the bass player uh, about three, four years ago, and he decided he wanted to learn how to play bass. So that's how I kind of got into it. I started teaching him how to play the bass, and I said, you know, I'm gonna keep teaching you. And once you get this down, then we're gonna start a band. So we're gonna do. And um, crazy thing, one day I walk into a smoke shop to go buy some cigarettes, and I see this guy there, and I'm like, this guy looks familiar to me. Didn't say anything to him. Walked out of the store, saw an I Love Guam sticker in the car. <laughs> I actually left the parking lot and came back. Went into the store and acted like I was looking for something. But I just needed to talk to him. I went back outside and I said, hey, bro, you guys are from Guam. And he's like, yeah. And I was like, why wow, you look so familiar to me? And he told me he was a keyboard player for this band who came in for Dedicated Minds who came and played at Guam Fest here. And I said, well, what are you doing in Vegas, you know? And he's like, oh, no, I live here now. And I said, well, are you doing anything musically? And he's like, and I was like, yo, bro, I want to start a band, you know? I'm looking for keyboards, you know? So we exchanged numbers. We were leaving the parking lot. And, I just called him and said, hey, just, that's, you know what, just follow me to my house, bro. Let's just go to the house and just talk <laughs> about this, you know. I, I couldn't let him get away, you know what I mean? Right, Solid right. connection. And that was it. Yeah. From right there, we just hit it off. Started the band, found a drummer. And we've been through a couple of drummers now, but, you know, um, the, the and, and the band that we have right now, everybody's been in for about two years now, so, you know, we have some pretty dedicated people right now, so it's, it's, it's good. I right got Remy Ram, man, another uh, talent uh, floating around the desert. Uh, he plays with the SD1. How's it, bro? How's it? Cool. <laughs> He's just getting over the heat, but uh, you know, we're still talking with ST1. Uh, you guys have, like, uh, we're talking about uh, the popular uh, popularity of uh, reggae music here in Las Vegas, and um, that's what you guys are uh, doing, and that's what you guys are providing for the community. Um, I mean, what do you guys? What's on the horizon for ST1? Well, ST1, you know, um, we just put together like a, a, a whole horn section, you know, and. Uh, there's been bands out there doing it, but you know it's hard to find a permanent horn section. So that's what we're kind of priding ourselves on. And now we got uh, the homie Remy Rem joining us, the best vocals in town. Yeah. You know, so all I gotta say is watch out. Watch out, Mariah. <laughs> we got Remy. <laughs> so it's gonna it's gonna be good. You know, I mean, with, with all the with all the promoters that we're working with, you know, it's pretty. It seems like it's a pretty friendly community that we have going on. You know, it's a very prideful thing. You know, um, bands like uh, Pohana, for instance. <laughs> If I don't think if if their guitarist's dad wasn't from there, they would have never became anything over there. You know what I mean? Right. So, I mean, just just because we're here in Las Vegas and we're doing this, we have the support of the whole island behind us. That's great. You know, we put on an EP, it will get played over there. And next yeah, you know, I actually went home for uh, uh, three months two years ago, and I got to hear some music playing out there. And then uh, not too long, he was telling me that uh, he just sent his. Uh, um, our original, the one that he wrote, um, In Time, and, and Sun is Shining. So that is getting some airplay on Guam too. So if you guys from Guam get this, hit the radios, request ST1, let's get the love and maybe next year we'll be seeing you guys. But where can they uh, find you guys? On your social media? Uh... Uh, it's just about Facebook, it's uh, ST1 Guam 702, you know. And it's not just Guam represent, you know, like our percussionist is from Hawaii, you know, we've got Samoa now. All right, we have a drummer from Chicago, Mr. Sean. We have a, our bass player from uh, from San Diego, California. We have a, our sax player, he's from uh, Humboldt. And our uh, percussionist, he's from Hawaii, too. Wow. So, so just a great mixture of people, man, getting it together and yeah. showing the love. Just at the, at the time, the two front guys are from Guam, so that's kind of like what we're doing. Well, you know, it's, it's, you guys are the creators and stuff like that. That's why I give you guys props, man, and doing what you guys are doing. And, try, represent, try. and representing the island of Guam. I'm island there in the middle of the desert, hanging with ST1. On the Nine! I hope you enjoyed this week's edition of the On the Nine segment. This is Shannon Yang, keep you informed on the Asian Global News. When we come back, Captain Kirk will join Nancy for the Dish of the Week. Switch to DirecTV today and get a free upgrade to the all-new Genie, our most advanced HD DVR ever. Genie serves your entire home with just one receiver, allows you to record any five shows at once, and gives you up to three times more HD recording capacity than cable. Order now and lock in your savings for two years. Other packages start at just $29.99 a month. So get all your TV wishes granted. Switch to DirecTV and get your free upgrade to Genie today. Welcome back to VA Asian Global News. I'm here with Captain Kirk, partner at Chinita Mexican Bar and Grill. He'll tell us about the dish of the week. 
Welcome back, Captain Kirk. Good to have you. How's it going this week? Good. good How are good. you doing? Good, good. All right. Well, this week we're going to spice you up a little bit. So these Ooh. are our uh, carne asada steak enchiladas. Mm -hmm. And I kind of had them do a little uh, creamy jalapeno sauce for you. So that way, uh, a little bit of flavor in there. Wow. Uses the white base cream, cilantro, chives, and the jalapeno. And it's got a lot of kick, one of my favorites. So give it a shot. Tell me what you think. Wonderful. Is this a special dish or daily? We try to feature something every week. It is okay. available daily, lunch special as well. And like I said, we try to feature it. So this is this week's uh, feature, steak enchilada, creamy jalapeno. Awesome. Can you please invite our viewers? Sure. Just on behalf of the family here at Chinita's Mexican Bar and Grill, we'd like to invite you to come on down and come see us. We're located at Sahara and Fort Apache in the Village Square Shopping Center. We also want to pay a special note to the firefighters out at Mount Charleston. We are going to be doing fundraising and some donation stuff out there. We're going to be taking food, water, and supplies out there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So if anybody would like to come by, you can drop them off here. We're also accepting cash donations that we can invest on that uh, behalf. Take a look on Facebook or at Yelp. You can get information as well. It's at Chinita's Las Vegas on Facebook. That's delicious. Good, good. Glad you enjoyed it. Have a little spice to it. Oh, oh yeah, lots of flavor. Great. Good, Thank good. you again. My pleasure. We'll see you next week. See you next week. This is Nancy Monse enjoying the Dish of the Week. Stand by for the Gaming Today Sports Bulletin. Watch us weekly and learn more about all the cool and new places to spend in Las Vegas in our neck of the woods this summer. And if you want to see us tape our weekly show, come to Chinita every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Look for Captain Kirk when you come in and mention the magic words, the Asian Global News, and you'll be given a special discount. And to all the jazz music lovers out there, come to Jazz Asian Nights, also here in Chinita, every Monday, 6 to 9 p.m. Jazz here in Sari and friends perform live, and jazz artists can jam the night away. Performers will be treated to welcome you. If you have any news items, videos, or photos of Las Vegas that you'd like to share with our viewers, please feel free to email them to us at theasianglobalnews at theasiantv.com or call us toll-free from anywhere in the United States at 866-936-2404. Stand by for Wine Du Jour. Have a blessed week, everyone. Bye. Bye. See you all next week. Give us a call. Asian TV, the community channel for Asian Americans in Las Vegas. Switch to Direct TV today and get a free upgrade to the all-new Genie, our most advanced HD DVR ever. Genie serves your entire home with just one receiver, allows you to record any five shows at once, and gives you up to three times more HD recording capacity than cable. Order now and lock in your savings for two years. Other packages start at just $29.99 a month. So get all your TV wishes granted. Switch to DirecTV and get your free upgrade to Genie today.